he, he's, he's so measured, and then mm -hmm. once he sees that tiny little edge, then he's going to make you pay. Exactly. So here we go, going on uh, Town and City as our, our first stage pick here. Uh, this is really both kind of a, a neutral stage for both of them. I mean, Mario enjoys the platforms, but then again, so does Captain Falcon. So yeah. it's going to be interesting how this plays out. Yeah, up till falling up there as well. He gets the whole Oh confirmed. my goodness! Dude, oh, he almost I, he almost got the stop from that. He almost finished with the ally yeah. swaggy uppie, but not quite that time. Uh, Falcon instantly in a horrible position to start this match. Yeah. That was a good, uh, good read. Always try to get the knee. That, that's actually a confirm at certain percents, and he mm -hmm. just barely got the weak knee on it. So. Yep. Yeah. yeah. Now you can see how, how careful Sensational is being uh, in neutral, just like not falling into JT Wild's traps. Well, he almost has to at 101%. I mean, Mario can kill you in a lot of situations at this percentage. Oh, wow. So. That double jump. He's trying to. Oh, going really high up in the air to try and get that. Might pay for it here with the punish, but no, good air dodge. Get out of there. Yeah. It was a pretty good, it was, a, it was an all right punish, but it wasn't as good as it could have been. Very smart from Sensation there, recovering high when GTI Wild goes low. It's all about the mix-up. He should have F-smashed that. If he got an F-smash there, he would just charge an F-smash. As soon as he saw that uh, JT Wild was charging an up-smash, he would have just died. JT Wild would just be dead. Oh man, but, oh, it's Sensational. Oh, he just doesn't just have a jump. unfortunately realizes that he has no second jump, doesn't up B, falls into the abyss for his first stock in a very unspectacular fashion, but oh my goodness, the knee! The falling knee on the air dodge read. Where you just know the exact timing and you know exactly when the move comes out. Millimeters above the ground and he just puts the knee of justice directly into Mario's back. That's some day one Falcon stuff. <laughs> that's what, that's like what you've been playing this Falcon since like November on 3DS. Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and like the timing is the same thing. They don't change the timing. There's no patches for that, no. And now it's looking like Sensational has taken complete control of this oh, game. Oh, th this momentum has absolutely changed, but here we go. Oh, here, here's wild. the shift. Let's see if JT Wild can keep this going like he did first time. Oh, he gets, gets the green grab. Up tilts. Oh, good, good up tilt to get out of that situation, I think. I, I would not have expected that if I was JT Wild there. Yeah. Oh, he's just trying to get the up air confirmed. He doesn't want to go for the raw knee this time because it's too risky. Misses the tech. Yeah. Okay, we, we safe now. We're back to neutral. Oh, wow. Back fist. Wow! Dana takes it out, no lightning or anything, so I don't know if that was just bad DI or what happened there, but JT Wild going down to cessation. Yeah, what happened was that when JT Wild was trying to come off of the platform, in order to continue coming off the platform, he had to continue holding right, and he was not able to immediately shift to the left after <laughs> after he got hit, so he didn't DI out of the hit stun, out of the hit lag rather, and uh, that's why he was able to hit, that's why he died right there. He was getting hit in the direction he was he was running into, and that meant that he DI'd towards the blast. Gotcha, alright, that, 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 that's, that's, that's a really good observation. Yeah, yeah, no, yeah, 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 yeah. That, that's ex yeah, and and unfortunately, there's not a lot you can do in that situation. You know, you're not expecting to nope. get hit, and all of a sudden, bam, and no no time to di, no time to yeah. adjust your fate whatsoever. Because if you know that you're going to get hit, then you wouldn't be doing that in the first place. And uh, oh, no. and that's that's a really um, like classic Falcon thing to do is to get the sliding grab and like just have to do the air dodge and then try and read either the double jump to get the uh, up tilt spike yeah. um, or to maybe go down and get a back fist stage spike, something like that. So Falcon actually has a ton of options. Wow, oh, this that. matchup is brutal. JT Wild getting this whole punch in the. Oh, and he gets the spike! Oh my goodness! Wow. After all of that, JT Wild gets demolished what? down into the abyss. Just a overextended slightly. Cessational saw his chance and just took it and JT spiked him. JT Wild pressing like 12 buttons to do like 90 damage. Cessational pressing one button to do 14 damage and a stock. Oh man. That's why some people play Mario and why other people play other people play Falcon. That, that right there. <laughs> That is should, awesome. That should honestly be a gift, frankly. Someone should odd-shot that. <laughs> that was, like, talk about a reversal of fortune right uh -huh. there. Like, that, that was, stock? Oh, if, okay. if you if you can show me any sort of gift or odd-shot or anything of momentum changing that quickly in yeah. any other match, please tweet me, like, because that was insanity. It was ridiculous. But yeah, All right. I know. So what Cessational needs to do here is need to keep up this momentum and not get trapped in any of these down throw to um, up tilt, up tilt to up air to almost death. You should not, not get hit by that combo. I think that if he doesn't get hit by that specific combo, he'll just be fine. But. He has to avoid a certain set of moves, falling up air, grab, up tilt. He has to avoid all of those moves. Yeah. JT Wild isn't only going for one of them. And that's they what, all cover for different I mean, different that's options. what JT Wild has been doing almost this entire time, though. He's only going for grabs into ah. this so he can build damage. I'm not sure if this man knows how to build damage any other way in this particular matchup. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, like, it's almost free on, on Falcon, though, because he's so combo heavy. So, you know, I can understand why he'd be, like, going for it so much, because all the stuff is safe, too. It's extremely safe. Mario's a safe character. Why well, he just ran across three fourths of the stage? <laughs> I mean, that's that's pretty much exactly what uh, Falcon's all about is is to close uh, that distance instantly. That DI yeah. was Ooh. so strange. He got down throw and went to the right. I mean, it, it kind of got him out of out of the situation, which is not a terrible thing to have. But I mean, jab one, grab, 
Down smash. Oh my Destroy. goodness, and the taunt. Seth Sational taking it 2-0 over JT Wild, one of the strongest Mario players in Illinois. So good job on Seth's kinda, part. Kind of bopping him a little bit. A little bit. I mean, when JT Wild was uh, was getting the punishes, you know, that's when JT Wild was really shining. But when it came to like sealing up the stocks, Sensational Dude, was just it, all it was it was almost like watching Sheik, like Sheik putting on like Mario putting on so much damage so fast with all of these combos and everything like that, and then all of a sudden Sensational's like, oh yeah, man, I, I forgot to tell you. I'm good at this game. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then just boom, stomp. I wasn't that good at this game like a year ago, but now I'm like kind of good at this oh, game. Oh, man. So uh, <laughs> while, while we got a second here, while we're waiting for the next match to start and for the crowd to chill with its hype.